Welcome to the weekend. I'm CBS4 meteorologist Asset Gonzalez here in Weather Control, and we are waking up to a chill in the air. Beautiful view from our Windjammer Resort camera, Lauderdale by the Sea. Aren't we lucky to be enjoying this weather? And we are still the envy of the nation. We are looking at very dry and quiet conditions on the radar and satellite. That should be the case throughout the day with high pressure and control. Low 50s in Kendall right now, and 55 in Miami, 54 in Fort Lauderdale, 61 down in Key West. The breeze out of the northwest, brisk, 9-12 miles an hour. It's going to keep it feeling uh, quite chilly this morning and we do have very low humidity due to that dry hair in place. So high fire danger today and we're going to start to see the humidity creeping back up as we head into tomorrow when we have more of an onshore flow as high pressure drifts off to the east into the western Atlantic. So uh, that will be a change. So today we are seeing those highs will be climbing to the mid 70s. It will be pleasant with plenty of bright sunshine. So you'll be peeling off a few layers as you head into the afternoon. If you're headed to the beach, very high UV index, so you'll need the shades and the sunblock. And as you can see, uh, low risk of rip currents are going to be going on. So you don't have to worry about the rip currents. And boaters, no advisories right now. Seas 3 to 5, a light chop on the bays. Tonight will be cool and crisp, 60 along the coast, in the areas of mid 50s. And tomorrow, many marches taking place, many events for the March for Our Lives movement. And for South Florida, the weather will cooperate. Yeah, we're seeing mostly sunny, mainly dry weather, and the high around 79 degrees. So it could be just a slightly warmer tomorrow afternoon as compared to today. And then even warmer on Sunday. Lows back to normal, close to normal with the low 60s. Highs a little bit above average with 83 and 84 on Monday with a chance for a few showers as a weak frontal boundary is expected to push in. And the breeze should be increasing by Tuesday until Wednesday of next week. You can check in on the weather any time of day right here at CBSMiami.com.